Fanatic. I'm uh, getting a lot of emails about how we do our stenciling here. So today we're going to give a big reveal exactly how we get our fine line stenciling done, dip done right. Now that we have the stencil on the car, prepped clean, we use our first coat, we're going to do a light coat, even coverage all the way across. Second coat, we're going to go right at it. Let that dry. Alright, before we finish up, talk a little bit about the vinyl we're using. It is the Oracle brand exhibition calendar, 631 low adhesive vinyl. Cuts really nice, weeds really easy, peels off, has a life indoor six, seven years, but we use it for about 30 seconds. Um, let's get to the next coat. Third coat will be the last one. Go a little heavier. At this point, we put three coats on. This thing has got plenty of coverage. Most people will be like, get this stuff off of here now. We're gonna let this dry completely. We'll come back in about 10 minutes. All right, now that this has been dry for 20, 25 minutes, our removal process is pretty simple. Microfiber and dip. So this is a tedious process and takes some time, but dip wants to stick to dip more than it wants to stick to this vinyl. And we've learned through all of our testing that as long as you're not overly aggressive, change spots on the rag on a kind of some regular basis, the dip will stay right in place. It's a little stubborn, just get the rag, fingers work. It really just is a matter of taking your time, going around the edges. All right, now that we have our results, peel this completely. We're going to remove our stencil and uh, see what we got. Take our jacket and knife, very gently pull.
All right, so at this point, we've got the stencil kind of picked clean. We're going to go around with the X-Acto knife very smooth, very quickly, and peel all this out, and we'll be done. It's going to take about another 10 minutes. We'll be right back. Best thing to do is recap. Put your stencil on, clean the area perfectly with your dip spray, put three coats on that, wait for it to dry completely 20 to 30 minutes, take your microfiber or your thumb, clean the stencil off, clean all the edges perfectly, and take your time peeling the stencil, you should have results like this as well. My recommendation is to do this with dip that's been on a hood for at least two hours. If you want to wait 24 hours, you can, but we've done it with good results, really up to 30 minutes, but I always tell people to wait. Um, thank you for watching, and hopefully you'll have good luck like we have.